we're going to see not last with the Peach against Cruncho's Joker. Opting to skip the hero this time. Like he's thrown out a couple of times earlier. It hasn't been serving him as well in the latter stage of the bracket. Loser semis. PS2. Again, perhaps, you know, not a stage that particularly favors one of them over the other, but if, you know, if Peach wants to find some of these tournament combos through the platform, and if either one of them isn't on point with their text, it could spell Doom early. Good down throw back air from not last. That's not... That's not the last time we'll be seeing that from him. With belly engage almost all the way full. As he evens out the percent before it comes out, and then some with the grappling hook. And now Peach, out of a jump, will have to just float back, and that is going to be food for the back air on Cruncho's part. Lands it twice in a row, no problem, before Arsene comes out. So now, not last, we'll have to deal with being stocked down while Arsene is active. Peach Bomber not safe if you don't fall off the ledge with it. He just misspaced. Floats back. Peach Bomber's his way back this time, grabbing the ledge while doing so. Not up air, up smash, rather. All hits connecting, no knockback reduction from 4.0. Down tilt, just fishing for them, is not last. These back airs are putting in the work for Cruncho. Doesn't quite get it this time. And just tilts the wrong way, but the back throw will send him right back off stage. A position not last has been all too familiar with so far in loser semis. Low back air from not last. Side views right back to the platform. Another back air, this time falling, but a bit higher. Just gets hit for the Oha for his trouble. Dash attack coming out. Run Cruncho and the bear as he falls down. Wow, that wasn't sure that would have killed, but Joker with Arsene is a killing machine. Even the moves you don't expect to kill and you absolutely do the job if you're not careful. Good drag down up air. Gets onto the platform. Good F tilt as well, gets him with the egg on. That last already two thirds of the way through his last stock. There's the final third with the back air. And the curtain. With the air, rather, any move when you're halfway to the blast zone off the stage. You know, that'll do it. And that's as clinical as it will get uh, from Cruncho with the Joker play. That is the exact situation Joker was made for. He's hovering over Hero for a second, as if to just mull it over. But no, this time, you know, he has gone Hero in the earlier stage of the of the bracket for those who stuck around. But you know, in, in loser semi is probably the time to bust out the main. Game two on to FD. Just some low back airs from not much to start. Gets the down throw to start into the up tilt. Not high enough percent for a back air follow up. Some more back airs from not last, but now Cruncho has sent stage. Falling aerial. Throws out the guns for the first time. Wouldn't be too effective of, uh, of an edge guarding tool of the guns, uh, especially when back air has that potential to hit a floating huge, but. Looks right back out of harm's way, and now our send something to deal with as well as the pressure and constant yeah. stage control being regained from Cruncho. Doesn't float off stage with that Peach Bomber once again, and he just gets back in time. But when you do just go, when you do throw out a Peach Bomber, and you're not absolutely sure it's going to connect, make sure to fall off stage if you don't. Up tilt, just going to miss. Cruncho and he'll eat a throw punish. Good up air. Not last. Avoids the turnip successfully and returns fire with the guns. Back throw from Cruncho. Wants the back air. Doesn't get it, but wasn't too far off as well. Out of the range of the forward tilt. And dash attack. Doesn't opt to pull another turnip. Interesting. I don't know 
if that's the option I would have gone for. You had enough space backward to just pull another turn up and dash attack in anyway. You were early too. You're gonna see the back throw from Joker. He's gonna want another bear if possible. He'll just a hob this time. Perhaps go for the guns as well. All ready for the second time in the first off. Arsene is out. And Arsene is ready to do work, reflecting that turn up already. Forward tilt across the stage, almost doing it. Although Beach's aerials strong enough to kill across the stage as well. So the dash attack from Peach putting in some early percent work, but not able to get more than 18% of extra credit before falling victim to one of the Joker's potent, potent moves. Good drag down up air as well. Gets him one time, just off to go for the up tilt the second time. It's extra damage, and it doesn't risk missing. Arsene is up air. Arsene is there. Just gets around the up air, throws out the egg air on. And reflects the turn of back from the off stage as if he knew. Each can edge guard with the nares and can probably go for the stage spike as well if she so desires. So, you know, that's not the only option that uh, Cruncho had, but it was the correct one as Cruncho is now one sock away from taking a 2-0 lead over the one seed of this tournament, not last. Just Rebellion gauges right by the ledge. Any, that would protect against any turnip that would be thrown out. Misses with the Aha. Dash pack, not quite. And I don't, that wasn't a great position. He was just unprepared to take any of that, and the turnip will send him right the side of the stage, a straight downward, and now this is looking a lot more, well it was looking a lot more even before he just kept getting these drag down up airs. His space is the back air, so not long we'll have a free ticket back on stage, but out the way of the a does not have a jump there, so not long to will, uh, will be doing very good to make it back, although, you know, 70% down with Arsene on his way. That's a lot to ask, certainly. I haven't seen too many just random forward smashes or anything. He's not getting desperate, although the fair catches him just as he was returning back, uh, back to the ledge at 90%. And I've, I've sung the praises of that fair all throughout today because Peach can throw it out at a moment's notice, but how, you know, how good is it when it can just get you out of any situation and put in work in not only neutral, but also advantage and disadvantage state? It truly is a triple threat of a move. But game three, uh, all even at one game apiece on the PS2. This is a lot a lot slower of a start. Both players just dashing back and forth, not being willing to be the one to get combo first. Unfortunately, that's a distinction. Not last will have to wear. It's a down, a downward up airs from Cruncho have been, you know, impeccably good at low percent. Dash attack from not last. Up air for a second time, a third time. Each bomber will put uh, will put Arsene out onto the battlefield. How is Peach gonna make it back that deep? Well, I you know, as much as I get worried every time Peach uses her jump and any Peach player is stuck just drifting back and forth on the stage, that is an art that they have learned very well. Good call out to the downward attack. Punch out, and these guns not gonna connect. Gets hit with the umbrella. Turn it into dash attack. And then up air on top of the platform. And another dash attack that is stale at the moment, so I'm not sure how good of a kill option that will be. That's another turn up in the fair falling down. Yes. Even with, you know, almost perfect DI, Crunchyo will fall victim to yet another one of these spares. 
good back air from Cruncho. And another back air from Cruncho, but that won't do it. The Aha will put Peach at an astounding 170%, and that will just do it. Cruncho didn't have, you know, so many people, you know, Joker's neutral option. He's busted. His, his kit is, has no flaws. People don't point out that besides back air, you know, without our scent, he does sometimes have trouble killing him. You just saw that on display right there. Gets him with the Aha. So not less percent will be taking up. Funko, meanwhile, rolling back. Catches the rollback. On the stage. The down smash. Not going to use its mark. The up tilt will. And the grappling hook is just barely off. Back air from Peach the Nair. Throwing out every move in the book. Good shield on the Egg Aeon. That could have been putting him into death percent if he wasn't careful. Avoids the up smash too. Out of the range of the second Egg Aeon, the back throw. He's just throwing out these Egg Aeons as if there's no other move that he has. Back to back air through the platform. The fair won't connect and just gives him a new haircut with that turn. Just raised in there. It's with the up smash, but Joker at too low percent to really be too worried. That up smash is just out of nowhere and that back row will be is just desserts. The back with the peach falling. And another back row. Will he go for the back air this time? No. He goes for the Aha. That doesn't connect. The back air from Peach will. Goes for the ledge jump, but doesn't work out and mistimes it. That won't be the answer he was looking for. Cruncho right, and that has to be an excellent time for you to get a kill. Right as Arsene comes out. You know, you can certainly worry that, oh, with Arsene out, I'll be at not only a stock disadvantage, but he'll be adding these extra percents and it'll make, you make it just that much harder to find a kill option, but good necessary back air. Pulls a turn up. We are about even percent, only five per well, only five percent for a moment separating. Misses the tech and rolls right into that grab. Crunch out now it's as if he just has everything not like he's doing on the palm of his hand. Open book. Just goes too low and he unfortunately floated down too low. May have been in hit stun for part of it, so the guns may have played a part. And obviously using the jump never helps, but Cruncho has a 2-1 lead in loser semis. So back to FD for game four. Once again, the Peach and Joker, two very highly regarded characters, two undisputed top tiers. Duking it out on one of the most iconic stages in the game, Final Destination. Early guns in front row. Interesting seeing it used on stage for the first time. You saw it secure game three as an on stage tool, but now he's using it in entirely new ways. Good landing aerial from Peach, but only that's going to fill the rebellion game. of Nair's on Cruncho's behalf. The forward tilt put into the shield and finds the down air up, down throw up air. Forward tilts him off the stage and not long, he's out of a jump. So, he turns back safely, the down air. Cruncho, not a move you see too often in Joker players, but, especially without Arsene active, but, utilized there. Utilize well. Right out of the lane. Really high. Arsene comes out. Flex the turn up right back. Return to sender. Just goes. It looked like he was going for the kill up, up special earlier, but if you're just gonna. You're just gonna float there. You're a floating open target. 
Cruncho puts some decent work with our Sen still active. You know, most Joker players might say, or some Joker players might say, well, all Sen is coming out. There is a bit of that window that can be punished during that exiting animation. So, you know, perhaps I'll just play defensive, but not Cruncho. He'll be rewarded with 35% of extra damage to start it off. And even though he just got hit by that back there, it's still 86% in the lead. Has control of that turn up as well. So, he has to recover on stage with the pink bottom. Floats above the forward snap. Interesting. And he's up air connecting twice in a row. Waits out the Rebel's guard. And no, he just, you could see it right there. He wanted the grappling hook, but Arsene came out at the very wrong moment. Upbeat onto the stage for whatever reason. Forward tilt, not quite gonna send him across the stage the full way, but this is how Central has to be played if we're going to be facing next Arsene. Good forward tilt to close it out. Buncho one stock away from losers finals to have to avoid that turn at first. Good back air. And even with Peach floating out here, he's still get three extra percent. Every percent counts. Down throw in the back air. Doesn't connect, but another. Gets the Saturn as well. And with that fair, now has a powerful tool to put the pressure on. Now Joker has control. Just gets rid of it. Discards it. Not needed. Floating airs coming in from not last. Pulls a turn up again into the shield. Up air. One, two. Just two for the moment. Arsene once again moments away from making an appearance. Shields what could have been a stitch face actually. That was very, very opportune for Crunch that it missed. Gets back with the X Spectral immune to any turnips. Not last would be throwing out in the opening stages of that animation. Covers his recovery with the egg on. That back, uh, that forward tilt is going to play with Peach. Both Crunch and not last above 100% into the triple digits. This is absolutely crunch time for the both of them. Puncho looking to get some of these throw combos, perhaps follow up with the back air off stage. Maybe get him with the guns a couple of times. The back air comes out once, gets him with it again. And that time just faces him and sends him directly into the blast zone. We saw him chase with the back air so many times, but that time just throws out a much more mature option. And that time it'll work out. He's being rewarded with a trip to loser's finals. Cruncho 